guys what's up welcome back to my channel so for today's video I'm gonna be telling you guys some new items that I recently got and I'm very excited to share them with you I have a few pieces in here I have my notes here I don't want to forget anything I already tried them on I'm just gonna go ahead and pull it up on the screen you know what I mean jelly bean Let's just go ahead and start with Fashion Nova. And I'm going to do my best to try to speed through these as quickly as I can. Um, just kind of tell you the pros and the cons of them. And then go ahead and keep it pushing. Um, so if you see this, my hair is just really short and I didn't want to put that much gel on my hair because my hairstylist told me not to. So I just left the very short part out. It doesn't look the best, but it is what it is. Okay, so from Fashion Nova, I got this orange dress. I love the color of this dress. The only thing I would say about this dress is that the shoulders are a little bit weird because I feel like it's supposed to be off the shoulder, but then it's big. I don't know. It's weird to me, but I still like the dress. The next dress that I got, I didn't do a try on haul in the mirror, but I did wear it before when I went on a date with my boyfriend. And so I'll just kind of insert a picture of what it looks like or a video. I love this dress. I love the color of this dress. It's very nice. Like, I just like everything about it. And I don't know if they still have it because my mom even wanted one and it was out of stock. So I don't know. So I have this yellow two-piece. Also, I did not get this in my mirror because I had tried to do a spring try on haul, but I just didn't like how my hair was looking with the outfits. I don't know. I got a new haircut and I'm just like figuring it out. Um, my boyfriend loves it though, so I don't know. I'm gonna try to figure it out. <laughs> this set is very comfy, very great for lounging around like these days. That's kind of what we do um, because of COVID and stuff, but things are opening up, so. so I am hopeful for what is to come. Hopefully, better days. Oh my god, this mint dress. Is, I just love it so much first of all I love the color of it the color is so it's so gorgeous to me and the fact that it's in silk I feel like it just elevates the dress I really like it I like that you can leave it open and also there's buttons on there so if you don't want to be so um, have you know be so inviting with the today's then you can close it up but for me personally I think it adds to the style and I must say that the dress itself is pretty damn short so if you're tall I would definitely size up it's longer in the back so it covers the bum and I don't have a big bum so yeah it works for me I really love it definitely definitely 10 out of 10 would recommend I also wore that mint dress in Tulum so if you saw my video I'm gonna link it up here for you to check it out if you want and then the next dress I also wore this dress in Tulum and it's very nice it's kind of simple but you can dress it up a little bit but I don't feel like it's super dressy or anything like that but it's cute like if you're having a little date night with the girls you know it's easy to throw on very simple and you can accessorize with like gold accessories to let it pop a little bit I think it's very nice I like that it wraps it kind of covers the little pouch if you got one. Oh, it's very crushed I should have steamed this I got these nude sandals I don't feel like there's too much to say they work perfectly fine they have a little bit of cushion in them so it adds comfort for your foot and it's not super flat to the ground which I love because I don't like when flat shoes are just flat like I might as well walk on the freaking hard floor and this goes with a bunch of different things if you have on a more dressier outfit on vacation and you throw these on it wouldn't be off you know what I mean speaking of like shoes slippers got these house slippers as well and I really love the color of them they had a sale on them so I thought it was perfect timing because I needed to throw away my old ones anyways so yeah they're very comfortable no complaints I'm wearing them right now <laughs> Oh my gosh, this hat that I got, I'm going to insert a picture because I kind of, it's already kind of put away and it's just so freaking huge, like it's enormous, like if I opened it up here on camera right now, it would have taken up the whole entire screen. Mainly I got it for photo reasons because come on, like it's kind of obnoxious. <laughs> okay, this purple corset, now first of all, I love that it's satin, I love the color of it and me, I'm not a purple person, but this lilac purple is so beautiful. Beautiful. I love anything pastel so I saw this I like this is great and I like having tops that you can kind of throw on with some jeans um, and then I have a struggle with this too I had to size up to an extra large because big boobs yeah, it's kind of hard to fit for me like I have to put something under to like hold my boobs to secure it, and then I can wear the top so this midi skirt I actually had it in my cart for some time now and then eventually I just decided okay Fashion Nova is having a sale let me just throw it in and it's one of those pieces where I feel like you can definitely dress it up dress it down throw on some black heels throw on some white sneakers or black sneakers I kind of wish it was shorter and like ruched a little bit I feel like that would be so cute but it's fine no biggie it's still cute it's still cute 
So let's go ahead and move on to Pretty Little Thing. So from Pretty Little Thing, I get this really cute cream set. Now there are certain things about the set that I'm not too fond of. Like the top part, I kind of wish it was a little bit more oversized. Do you know how the fit looks when you have like that vest and then like the button down and it kind of fits like a dress and you just throw on some boots? I've been wanting to do that style for some time and I thought maybe, okay, I will be able to do that with this because it's a two piece. I don't have to wear them together, but it kind of doesn't give me the right fit so I don't know I'm, in, I'm gonna try it see what happens but that's my only con about the top now the bottom believe it or not I wish it was longer um, I just kind of feel like the crotch area fits a little bit weird nothing major just a little bit aside from all of that it's cute these sneakers are the most comfortable sneakers that I own to date okay well <laughs> you definitely need these sneakers in your collection now if you're one of those people that's like no these look too much like the Yeezys don't these look too much like Balenciaga you're not gonna do it because the name isn't on there then I get it you know what I'm saying it's always good to get one that has a name on it because you could like flex on people like hey hey but I don't really need to do that because first of all they're $34 they're hella comfy and they still give me that same exact feel as if I were to own those sneakers, you know what I mean? So I'm not really big on that. Eventually when my pockets can match, then we could talk. I love them so much that I own them in two different colors. So I have them in a stone color, which you may have seen. I feel like I might have thrown it in a lookbook before. That's how much I love them. That's how much you need them. I'm just saying, like, ain't nobody paying me to say these things, you know what I'm saying? So... Next thing that I got from them are these boyfriend fit jeans. Now, like most things in my collection, the waist is too big, so I'm gonna have to take the waist in a little bit. But I love that they are actually baggy on me because I have a hard time finding boyfriend jeans that fit like boyfriend jeans because I have really thick thighs. Um, you know, I would just wish my thighs would share with my butt, but it doesn't work like that. But from Shein, I mean, this would be a haul. I didn't got Shein in it. So the first thing that I got is this white bag. I don't own a white bag, so I was like, oh, you know, let me get one. And before, I was trying to. Since I have it right here, I could just show you. So this is the first bag that I got that I thought was white from Shein, but it ended up not being white. But I kept it anyway because I love it. Okay. Ooh. See, this is actually white. Very, like, minimalistic, so I thought that was really nice. It has a little bit of ruching on it. And if you do get anything on it, because I did, you can just easily wipe it off, which I really like because of the material of it. And, yeah, I just think it's very cute. I like it. You can definitely see that color difference, right? And then, also, I got this metallic green button down. Now, I love the color of this the color of this is so beautiful to me I've been loving this color a lot lately too even in my past birthdays I've been wearing this um, but yeah this color is beautiful to me the only downside to this is that the material is itchy like ew why why and it's like itchy on the shoulder so it's just like if you don't wear like a, a shirt that has like a quarter it, what is what what kind of sleeve is this it's not a quarter sleeve is it a quarter sleeve? It's just uncomfortable. I don't know. Ugh. And then I got these really cool zebra pants. Um, the waist on these are a little bit big. Just a little bit. But it's not a big deal. So I don't really feel the need to go take it in. So yeah. But I love these pants so much. They're so comfortable. They flare out at the leg. And it's a brown and um, beige color. So the colors are just so nice. And I just freaking love it. I would just... If I could, what I would do is wear one of those, you know those triangle um, crochet tops? I feel like that would look really cool with it. Or like a crisscross top like this would look nice too. Yeah. I haven't shopped with Boohoo in a very long time, but I got two things from them. The first one is this magenta top that has um, like a yellow raw trimming all over the front of the top. The back is just plain. So it's, in, it's just all in the front and then you have some strings that are hanging as well and it's like, it's a little short turtleneck. You can like unfold it and then it gets higher, but I'm gonna wear it a little bit shorter. I actually thought this set was a dress when I first saw it on Boohoo, but it turns out to be a set and I'm not mad at that because I can wear them separately or together. Um, sets are just really cool to me because you don't really have to think too much about them. So yeah, and plus like I said, I've been loving orange lately so this was right up my alley. The only thing I would say is because I have large boobs I would have to figure out the bra situation which is always annoying but the bottoms are nice the waist again is big on these um so 
Yeah, and what I really like about this set the most is that you can customize it because you can adjust the ruching to however you want it. You can have an asymmetrical hemline, make it long, like whatever you want to do. So for ASOS, I got these cool pants. Now, I don't know how to style these pants. I just know that I really like the print of them. I like the way that they looked. I just realized recently though that they're from the petite uh, section. So they're very short, which sure I'm short, I'm 5'4", but it's just like, those are too short. Like I need them to be a little bit longer. Okay, so now the last place that I'm gonna be talking about is Miss Lola. I've been buying a few things from Miss Lola lately. So I got this yellow dress. Now the thing about this yellow dress is it's, shapeless like there's absolutely no shape and if you don't come with the shape the shape isn't included okay shape sold separately don't like that it's so straight like it doesn't do anything for me at least like the the waist should have been like a little bit cinched in you know what i mean but i guess that's just not the the vibe or the fit of the dress so it is i like the material i love the color of it i like that it's ribbed but i don't like that it's shapeless if I have to take a photo, I would have to like add the shape myself, like hold it up a little bit, kind of, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I also got these glasses because I'm not sure if I showed them in the little try-on section. Cute ass glasses. I love the shape of it. The shape is very different. I feel like Desi Perkins came out with um, some glasses like this, but oh, I hate this little back. I like that it's this clear yellow, like pastel yellow shade and wow, it matches this so perfectly. We're just gonna keep that on this dress right here girl let me <laughs> so the reason I love this dress so much is because of this very reason I mean aside from it looking hella cute and it being peach oh my god I love this dress the strap allows me not to have to wear a bra you don't understand this is a big deal for me because if it's a strapless piece anything dress top I think that's where it stops dress so top. I have to find a strapless bra and I have a strapless bra but it makes my boobs look like Kim Possible so ill. The straps are adjustable so I can adjust it like I'm wearing a bra and it will hold my boobs in place. And to top it all off the dress itself is really nice. The side you have this beautiful split honey and then you can adjust the ruching. Zoop! All the way you gonna see my chicken thighs. <laughs> bruh my strap popped I was like yo mom I got this dress and I need to know if it can be fixed she was like it can be fixed I was like all right cool cool because if not I would have ordered another one straight away that's it y'all we got through it I hope this video wasn't too long I bet you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and if you didn't like it please tell me why you didn't like it like I want the feedback so just share down below. Destructive criticism is always welcome here. Don't forget if you are feeling this vibe go ahead and subscribe and before I go I do want to say thank you to, to those of you who have recently subscribed. Um, I really appreciate your support for my channel. Did not forget to do my skincare video. That video is on its way. It's just um my skin has been going through some stuff and I feel like as soon as you asked me for that video girl my skin has just been on one.